Ariel Helwani post-fight at UFC 113 with Josh Koscheck, who defeated Paul Daly tonight. And first off, Josh, congratulations on a very big victory. I hate to take away from the victory, but obviously the end was a little ugly. In your opinion, what exactly happened out there? Uh, you know, I you know, was talking to him in his ear just a little bit, let him know that, uh, you know, some of the things that he said on the countdown show weren't very polite. And uh, he didn't take too uh, kindly of it. So, uh, you know, he started eye gouging me. And, uh, you know, first off, the guy's a, a blatant cheater. You know, he, was, he had, uh, you know, oil all over him. So, you know what, I just stuck to the game plan. The game plan was to be conservative, get the victory any way I could, take him down, wrestle, you know, go back to the old school a little bit. And, uh, you know, I had a lot of riding on this fight. And, uh, you know, I played it conservative and uh, had to get the victory. So you felt as though he was oiled up? Um, thank you. Uh, yeah, you know, I think, uh, you know, I could smell it from, from the, the, the beginning. So, uh, you know, no big deal. Uh, you know, I knew what I had to do, and that's go out and get the victory, you know. But I was telling the guys earlier, this is, was, a, was a big test for me, you know, to get here for this fight. Uh, you know, lots of things went wrong in training. Um, you know, not making any excuses, but, uh, you know, it was the toughest training camp of my life. A lot of personal issues. God, I, I thank God that, uh, just want to thank God that uh, uh, being on my side and, uh, you know, he, he, he got me here and got me through this. Do you want to talk about a little more what went wrong? Nah, just, you know, personal issues and, you know, it's, uh, that, that's the extent that I can go, 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 go with. So, but I made it here and, uh, you know, guess what? Uh, this, is, this fight's in the past now and now I'm focused on, uh, you know, becoming a better fighter so I can uh, go out and perform and, and beat J George St. Pierre. Do you think the UFC should cut him for what he did? Well, you know, that's not my opinion, you know. Uh, Paul Daly's a good fighter. Uh, he's a tough fighter, one-dimensional, but he's a very tough opponent and, uh, you know, I think he'll be back to fight another day. Obviously, your takedowns in your wrestling were a big factor in terms of why you won the fight. Uh, a lot of people are questioning, you know, will you stand with him? It seems as though you were able to execute your game plan perfectly, right? Yeah, exactly. You know, look at George St. Pierre, what he did to, to Hardy, you know. Uh, I watched uh, that fight 25, 30 times, you know. Just, uh, you know, George, good wrestler. And, uh, you know, I wanted to show my wrestling tonight. And uh, I want to thank uh, Zinkin Entertainment, Bob Cook, you know, all the guys at, at AKA. You know, I had a... Shogun one? Sounds like you just did. Holy sh Wow, I called that too. Our locker room's undefeated. Yeah. How about that? Uh, geez, wow. Um, but, uh, you know, I just, uh, I just, you know, yeah, man, I don't even know. I'm speechless, you know. Okay. I just have to ask about the knee. A lot of people are booing you. They said that, you know, you embellished. Did he, in fact, hit you in the head with his knee? Yeah, absolutely, you know. Um, hit me with something while I was down. So I don't know if it was a knee, fist, or what, but I got hit pretty hard. And, uh, you know, uh, I could have could have quit, and I got up and, and kept fighting. So. Next up, the ultimate fighter in George St. Pierre. Are you ready for this? Yeah, this is going to be great. You know, this is a dream come true. And, uh, you know, like I said, I, I was very conservative this fight, and I apologize to my fans, uh, you know, but I had to get the victory, you know. I, I've had a, a crazy career, ups and downs, wins and losses, and, you know, uh, just a lot of stuff. And uh, here I am, you know, 13 wins in the UFC. Who would ever figure a guy from the ultimate fighter would, uh, would, would be uh, in this position? And, uh, you know, it's, 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 a, it's God's blessing that I'm here, and I'm, I'm super excited. Well, congratulations on the victory, Josh, and congrats on the Pens winning tonight. Uh, yeah, the, the Pens. Did they win? They did win, two one. Yeah. That's, I, I don't think you knew that when you were talking no, to them, right? That. No. So they're up uh, three to three to two. They're they're up three to two. Game right. game six on Monday. Oh, there we go. You got some extra security going around Montreal tonight after well, that comment. I think I'll be wearing a hoodie and a, and a toboggan tonight, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna have security, or else I, I'm not going out. All right. Thanks, Josh. Thank you.